So you might be trying to go through and figure out how you can connect your Apple Pencil USB-C to your iPad. Now, doing this is actually very, very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. So the very first thing you need is you need an Apple Pencil, right, like this one. You need a USB Type-C iPad, so the iPad with the USB Type-C port at the bottom. And then you need a USB-C wire. As long as you have those three things, you are pretty much good to go. So once you have all those things, the first thing you wanna do is you wanna grab your USB Type-C wire that looks like this, and you wanna go and plug in one side to the edge of this Apple Pencil. So go and plug this into the Apple Pencil just like so. And then what you wanna do is you wanna grab the other side of this specific iPad, and you wanna go and find that USB Type-C port, which is right there, and all you're going to wanna do is plug in this USB Type-C port at the end of this specific iPad. Now when you do that, you'll see this little prompt come up at the very top that shows like the Apple Pencil, whatever like this. And that means your Apple Pencil is now technically supported and plugged in to your iPad. Now it may take a few moments, so just leave it, like set it there for like a couple seconds. And once you see that pop up, you should be good to go. Now what you can do is you can go ahead and you should be able to just tap on the display and just like this. And you should see that the Apple Pencil is now completely connected to your iPad. So if I bring my iPad like this, you should see everything works. Now, if you make your way over to your settings application, if you make your way over to your Bluetooth options, which is right here, you should be able to see your Bluetooth you know, devices that are connected, and you should be able to see that Apple Pencil. As long as you see that Apple Pencil there, that means this device is fully connected, and then you're pretty much good to go. What I'd also recommend doing is basically seeing where this little battery widget is. It should be on the side here. Go ahead and add it to your main display so you can keep an eye on the battery life of your Apple Pencil. So that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that'll be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.